here we go now for the final one final battle of Falkirk. the only way that we can hold the body lowlands around Falkirk is to build a castle and as many walls as we can construct in a short time these fortifications will serve to protect our camp as we construct siege weapons with which to assault the English castle. Once the castle is constructed, Wallace himself is sworn to join our forces. Together, we will attack Longshanks and his English troops. Build a castle and destroy the English castle as the previous classic one. Everything is as such. Different civilizations have fought different friends. Advanced commands interface, okay. Scots are restricted to a population every top 100. That's good enough. English has strong presence to the south. Alright, let's start. The English could attack at any time. You have some walls already, but you should complete them as soon as you have enough stone. Rob Wigger Rob Wigger Bit fear Rob Wigger Kid Rob Wigger Rob Wigger Margaret Hall You can also build towers to defend your city. Units can garrison within a tower for defense and protection, and archers can even fire out of a tower. Kid Trebach Kia Trebach Algranit Alabunit Rob Wigger Rob Wigger Forgera Rob Wigger Airlove Rob Wigger If you have surplus resources of one type, you can sell them for gold at your market. You can then use the gold to buy what you need. To build a castle, you must first advance to the next age, the Castle Age. There comes the long bid fear. The advanced buttons let you set combat states for your soldiers. A defensive soldier will be less likely to attack an enemy that comes near him. Click a military unit, then note the combat stance buttons in the lower left corner of the screen. Using the advanced buttons, you can also command a soldier to patrol an area between two points and guard or follow another unit. Rob 
The advanced buttons allow access to a new type of formation. For example, with a box formation, you can protect a weak unit, such as a monk. Kid, Bonnet, Kia, Rob Wigga. You have enough resources to go to the castle age. You should do that soon. Valgara Kia Bonit Bonit Cat Bitfield oh. Congratulations. You're going to find lots of things to do in the castle age. For starters, try building a siege workshop to make battering rams and other siege weapons. Tall. 
here. Good though. Good job. With your new siege workshop, Jet. you can make battering rams. Rams are slow, Ram but wouldn't. they are resistant to arrow fire and excellent at knocking down walls. You may need some rams to attack the English castle. You may need to assign extra villagers to gather yeah. stone, so you'll have enough to build the castle and all the fortifications you need. Great. You have completed the castle. Sir William should be here soon, and then it will be time to attack the English. Wallace has come. Kid? Wallace has come. Burgundy. One of your most powerful units is created at the castle. Create ten more ward raiders. Kid, near again. Bid fear. Erla. <laughs> With William Wallace and his ward raiders on your side, the English may be in trouble. Once you have a large army with plenty of siege weapons, Go destroy the English castle. Have love. Pogo! Pogo! Bid fear. Kid? Bid fear. Have love. Kid? Burgundy. To. Kid? To. Selgara. Selgara. Gia. Tho. Selgara. Erlev. Tho. Gjart. Bithir. Tho. Gjart. Selgara. Erlev. Bargare. Kid, Bargare, To. Kid, Nianaka. To. Rob Wigan, Erla, bid fear. Kid, To. Erla, bid fear. To. 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 Bargare, bid fear. Kid. Bargare, to, to pay, have love, to, bid to, fear. to. Kid, Bargare, Duncan. 
Bid fear. Margaret. Bid fear. Bid. Erlov. Kid. Tall. Bid fear. Duncan. Margaret. Erlov. Bid fear. Margaret. Bid. Tall. Bid fear. Tall. Margaret. Duncan. Erla, Bid fear. Kogo. Kogo. Kopet. Erla. The English castle at Falkirk is no more. The English pretensions in Scotland are surely at an end. The forces of Wallace are triumphant.
It looked certain that we would be defeated at Falkirk. Yet somehow, though outnumbered and outranged by English longbows, we were victorious. The English castle was torn down, and a Scottish one shall be built in its place. William Wallace has shown us the path to victory. Although he is but one man, he inspires great deeds in others. Many of the Scottish knights and lords have drawn their swords with his. Wallace's own sword is a five and a half foot beast. Forced, of course, in Scotland. <laughs> he has sworn not to rest until his sword finds the neck of Edward Longshanks. The struggle will continue, for we have learned the ways of war. Now, what is the English you fear? Building is nine, largest army forty two. 